rara porque estamos asustados, estamos asustados con todo lo que está pasando, pero la verdad que es una maravilla, estamos fascinados.
no sabría ni cómo describirlo porque es que es algo majestuoso. A pesar del daño que está ocasionando a un montón de familias y todo, claro. con la destrucción de sus casas y su trabajo, es algo asombroso que nadie va a poder ver a saber hasta cuándo y es una suerte dentro de lo que cabe viviendo en una isla volcánica pues ver esta maravilla, sinceramente. Lava blocks the size of buildings falling from La Palma volcano. Blocks of molten lava as large as three-story buildings rolled down a hillside on the Spanish island of La Palma while a series of tremors shook the ground on Sunday three weeks after the volcanic eruption. There were 21 seismic movements on Sunday, with the largest measuring 3.8, the Spanish National Geological Institute Ing, said shaking the ground in the villages of Mazo, Fuencaliente and El Paso. The blocks of red-hot magma flowed down the side of the Cumbre Vieja volcano were the size of three-story buildings, the Spanish Institute of Geology and Mining said on Sunday. There was a partial cone collapse near the volcano's emission vent on Saturday, Stavros Maletlidis, a spokesman for Ing told Reuters. The collapse of the northern flank of the Cumbre Vieja volcano has caused the release of large blocks of material and the appearance of new flows that run through areas already evacuated, tweeted Spain's National Security Department. The lava has reached the Camino de la Gata industrial estate and new buildings. Lava flows after part of the cone of the Cumbre Vieja volcano collapsed on October 10 in La Palma. Rivers of lava have destroyed 1,186 buildings since the eruption on September 19, the Canary Islands Volcanic Institute said. Lava has engulfed 493 hectares, 1,218 acres, of land, said Miguel Ángel Morquende, technical director of the Canary Islands Volcanic Emergency Plan PVOLCA, organization. About 6,000 people have been evacuated from their homes on La Palma, which has about 83,000 inhabitants. Lightning was seen near the eruption early on Saturday. A study published in 2016 by the journal Geophysical Research Letters found lightning can be produced during volcanic eruptions because the collision of ash particles creates an electrical charge. talk about intense we've been following this for now what a couple of weeks this is new video though showing lightning and volcano erupting this is on the spanish island of la palma we've been talking about this for quite some time the volcano is still erupting for three solid weeks 
New concern this morning after a cone collapse created another river of molten lava on the island, which now threatens even more structures. And keep in mind, more than 1,100 buildings have been destroyed so far. It just keeps erupting. And that Kevin. looks yeah. really problematic. I mean, that looks scary. Yeah, and that was a dirty thunderstorm. When these things erupt, there's so much friction between the particles that are just getting ejected and so much heat that can cause lightning. This is not just a thunderstorm rolling through. The volcano itself wow. erupting can cause lightning as it erupts, and that is a sign of a very powerful eruption. And as you mentioned, we're three weeks into this, so a very long-lasting eruption as well. Lava engulfed more buildings on the Spanish island of La Palma on Saturday, the magma destroying everything in its path. The red-hot volcano eruption swallowed at least four buildings in the village of Callejon de la Gata, according to Reuters witnesses. Jose Roberto Sanchez lost land inherited from his parents because of the lava. The land I had in Toroque is all gone. Yes, the memories of my parents, the inheritance I had there, it's all gone. <laughs> There was also a series of 37 seismic movements on Saturday, with the largest measuring 4.1, according to the Spanish National Geological Institute. However, La Palma's airport did reopen on Saturday after being closed since Thursday because of ash, a Spanish air traffic operator said. Since the Cumbre Vieja volcano began erupting on September 19th, it has destroyed over a thousand buildings and engulfed acres and acres of land, according to the European Commission Copernicus Emergency Management Service. About 6,000 people have been evacuated from their homes on La Palma, which has about 83,000 inhabitants.